So today we'll be going over how to replace the push catches for a Fantex case. Looks something like that. Now once you remove the top of the case, it's a lot easier to do. I didn't know you could remove this, but here's what we're looking at. Okay, you should see that there's a little catch right right here. Catches on this white that's built on. And if you press that in, hear that click, you do it on both sides, most likely you'll have to put it down on a surface, maybe grab a friend. And then put just a little screwdriver tip on both sides, pushing in these tabs. And then it presses out. And just presses out. Top looks something like this this is out. Now you are able to just, um, if it's in there, you are able to just press a screwdriver really hard through the top and you actually break those tabs. I did that on this side not knowing how to really get it out because at the time I didn't have this top piece off. But trying to pry, pry it out I learned that this comes off. So then I ordered these off of eBay. I'll put a link down below. They're, I don't know, $7 from like England. Um, so, yep, they just slip right in. And then you just kinda hear those clicks. I don't clicked because it worked. I don't clicked. And now they work. Uh, both of these clips do not work. I mean, there's this no click. And I, they, I bought this case from a person used, and the guy said, you know, it's supposed to work. And I'm like, well, it doesn't. So I did some searching and was able to find. Uh, these clips on eBay for fairly cheap and now I just got to replace them and now I don't have to deal with um, it sticking up and this is for the uh, dust filter so thank you all for watching and maybe I'll have another informational video to give you guys see you.